Hey, I want to give you a quick review on this East Oak umbrella. This is a retractable solar umbrella, which is cool because it actually has solar lights on the inside. I'll show you some of that uh, tonight. Uh, after it gets dark, I'm going to have them on and there's a solar panel. Now, the best part about this is this thing retracts down into a simple, uh, I just, you just unwind it like this. You'll see it here in a second. Uh, drop it down here. I can actually use one finger to do it. I just keep so it retracts pretty quick, right? So it's just like this. And then if you look at it, uh, it, it doesn't take up a lot of space. Now, what happens here is this, let me show you this is to get this to where it would kind of come in a little be a, be a little more compact um, all i got to do is i just flip this up because this is kind of your lock mechanism and pull down it doesn't take a lot now you do have to just let me show you this real quick just so oh, sorry in case you have to do this is this keeps this lock in place so in case you try to pull this down if this does not go up then you're not going to get it but anyhow put it down like that and then what i'm going to do is i'm just going to pull this down and it'll slide and it locks right in place like this. And then there's actually a, a, a thing you can tie it up with and so on. Now, let me just show you real quick what's nice about this is the assembly is easy. There's nothing to it. Pretty much everything's together, uh, except that you do have to put the pole down into here. It just goes into there and then you kind of tighten these little brackets, uh, these little things right here. And then you just have to screw these on. It's only four screws, which is nice. And then these two pieces just kind of cross over together like that and you screw them in tight. Now I would suggest, because this is a heavy, uh, a heavier top umbrella and because of balance, you're gonna want to uh, get either some stabilizers or drill them. I have them out here at my pool, as you can see. Uh, so if, uh, if I'm out here in my pool. Now, last thing is, let me just turn this a little bit, is this is where the solar panel is right there. I don't know if we're going right towards the sun or not. But the solar panel is on there and how that hooked up is it just, uh, you just basically take that thing and connect it and put it together. But if you're looking for one, uh, I would even recommend two. <laughs> but anyhow, if you're looking for an incredibly gorgeous uh, umbrella, I'll throw in the, the night part of this shortly. Um, this is definitely the one to get uh, because, and it's easy to put up. You just crack that up like this, lock that on, lock that in place. And then all I gotta do is crank it up. And I, probably one of the things too, is it's great for, obviously when I have guests that don't wanna sit in the sun the whole time with the pool. And, but if you look at this, and this covers a big area too. So I've got a nice table here that I can, uh, I can I've put a nice four person table under here and it still gives a good draft. And if it's uh, windy, let me just show you this. Uh, you'll see that it can actually move around a little bit. So there's some flexibility there too. But, Again, make sure you got it stable, because uh, it's obviously, if I have it like this, it's gonna tip over. Uh, just put different bases on here, but if you're looking for one, this is absolutely the one to get. You're going to love it. And through the power of editing, this is amazing. So here we are with the solar lights on. Uh, you can turn these on and off by yourself, so I'm gonna show you that right now. So it obviously charged in the day because it was in the sun, like I showed you, but then there's just a couple switches right here. So you've got two switches, they're just like normal switches and then I can uh, go ahead and if I push this one, the center light will turn off and if I push the other one, it'll turn that on. I could have just the center light by itself or I could have the combination of both together, uh, which I like the combination of both together because it just looks awesome. Um, there's plenty of light out here. You could actually play cards, you could read, you could do things like that, that it does give enough brightness right here that I could read even in a low light setting. But um, I also, I like the glow of these lights. These lights have a really nice, a warm glow to them. They're not necessarily that real bright, sharp things. They just kind of feel good when you're around them. Um, but pl uh, plus with it going out like that, it just gives a really good look to everything. So if you're looking for an umbrella that's going to change everything and you're going to get a lot of great compliments on it, uh, go pick one of these up. You're absolutely going to love it.